Ireland Murray reporting with Denise Trescott behind the camera. Disney Plus recently debuted November 12th, 2019, already harboring 10 million viewers. Shows exclusive to the streaming site also debuted with the site's launch, such as High School Musical The Musical, Noel, Encore, The World According to Jeff Goldblum, and many more. I prefer Disney Plus over all the other streaming services because I watch Disney a lot and I'm really interested in Star Wars and Marvel and that's what Disney Plus has. What I'm excited for about Disney Plus is the upcoming uh, episodes for The Mandalorian because I really enjoyed that. According to CNET.com, Disney's head of content and marketing for Disney Plus, Ricky Strauss, said at a media event that there aren't any plans to bring Spider-Man Homecoming and Spider-Man Far From Home to Disney Plus. I don't like that they don't have all the movies and shows on there because Spider-Man is not on there and it was something I was very interested in watching. I am going to be t purchasing Disney Plus just because I want to watch Mandalorian and Phineas and Ferb. I'm excited about that because I don't have to buy every Marvel and Star Wars movie. I prefer Disney Plus over Hulu because it has more movies and shows that I like. Future shows to come onto Disney Plus include Marvel's The Falcon and Winter Soldier, Loki, WandaVision, and others to come in the next year. Disney Plus is currently available for $70 a year. Now back to the studio.